If you are looking into buying cheap and safe FIFA coins, look no further than footcoinshop.net. They have the fastest service, an incredible loyalty reward system, and the best prices around. Use my creator code INCEPTION when you sign up for your account and get a 5% discount with your order. Hey guys, what's going on? Inception here and welcome to another video. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, today we have the new Luis Figo to check out. I'm guessing that this is going to be an SPC. I'm guessing. The reason why I'm guessing is because FIFA Romania tweeted this out. And I really don't think they're going to put like a Rui Costa or something. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I think it's going to be a Figo card and I think it's just going to be the base. Obviously not the new version. So because we did end up packing him on one of my accounts from the Icon SPC, literally it was the best one considering all the players you could potentially have gotten from the ones that I packed for people, even myself, all that stuff, right? Um, it should be interesting to check him out. He's 5'11", high, low work rates, four-star skills, four-star weak foot. This video might be really long because I don't think I play squad battles on this account one time. So that's a lot of stuff that uh, I have to see if I still have the footage because it's been a while, right? Uh, play styles. He's got Power Shot, Dead Ball, Whipped Pass, Trickster, Flair, Trivella, and the Technical Plus. The Technical Plus is a very huge variable to work with in the game nowadays, right? In-game attributes, this is how the card is formatted. So you could either go in the direction of giving him a Hunter Chemistry style, or you go in the direction of giving him uh, a Finisher Chemistry style, because the Hunter will still boost the shooting. But you guys know how I am when it comes to this game. I feel like I need to put the finishing above a 95 as much as possible for consistent enough finishing you know i i just personally needed it as as much as possible uh, the reason why i'm okay with this is because if the if the play style on a hunter is for pace to utilize the high low work rates which you could totally do right i'm okay with this because you have to understand that when you boost his dribbling with a finishing on a technical plus it, it kind of helps the technical plus part of the card okay so i want to try that out passing on the card is in a decent area physicals in a decent area he has an 85 for stamina uh but the high low work rates is always an interesting thing to take a look at so um honestly if i packed this on the rtg accounts that we're going to be doing an episode for that would have been awesome but yeah this account is um this account is just like the other one that i may or may not play on now it's it just depends right so um yeah we'll go ahead and get into the highlights well i'll see how much footage i still have because it's been such a long time but yeah we'll see what the vibes are man let's see how he's like Typical medical, we'll take it. Oh, that that little delay on the pass is what screwed me there because I would have gotten a full screen opportunity for sure. Nice pass. Oh, a little bit of that quickness there with Figo. Oh, dude, that first touch was awesome, man. Warrigal. Eat it. Annual goal keep that, you loser. Horrible mechanic. Yeah, do your kickoff again, nerd. Welcome to this game. Welcome to this game. There it is. There it is. There it is. Meta. Trying to keep 
I'm the best player in the game, guys. I am the best player in the game. My skills are unmatched. Oh man, I have mounted to something too. There it is. Beauty. Beauty, beauty. Beauty, beauty. There we go, there we go, there we go. Laurigal. Wow. War game. This game is hilarious, dude. Oh my goodness gracious, what did I just see? <laughs> Luis Figo! Let's go. Fantastic goal. Warrigal, 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 best player in the game, best player in the game, best player in the game, Warrigal. I'm literally so good at this game, guys. Amazing. Look at that skill. Oh, I thought he wasn't going to score. I, I was like, I couldn't see the ball. It was a beautiful pass, though. I put this clip in because it's kind of cool that he lets the ball go to let the other guy score because he's in a better position, you know? I was solid because it registers to the pass that I actually did, you know? There it is. There it is, boys. He has a five-star week for that, too. Oh, watch the kickoff. Really? Really? Okay. That's what I gotta do, man. That's what I gotta do. Sorry, guys. I'm just dying at the fact that, like, when I'm watching my highlights, I'm just, like, so sad that I have to score those goals. <laughs> uh, I mean, listen, he's gonna be good in the meta of the gameplay because Technical Plus is such a huge variable to work with to get into those areas at the right time. Uh, now, let's talk about him generally, right? So, obviously... <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh, obviously, with this card, guys, you can go either direction, right? You can give him a hunter chemistry style, or you can give him an engine or or a finisher. Excuse me. This is the best version of Figo we've ever had in any FIFA game, right? Because of the play styles, making him way more usable. Because he has good play styles, right? He has, um, you know, whipped pass. He's got flair, trickster, trivella. Technical plus is the biggest one, to be fair. It's the biggest one. Um, some people are not really going to care about the whole like left stick situation with this card. I care about it more because obviously when you give him the Hunter, he's still not in the mid 95s area and I need it, right? Because you guys can see that one green time strike that we scored right in the beginning. It was still kind of based off of the middle, right? And if I had it a little bit lower, even if I green timed it, 
it would still probably be a really, really weird shot. So that's why I like the finisher on him because sure, there are certain situations where I can't really utilize the pace to its maximum capability, right? However, uh, because the card does have the technical, that's basically like my running style with him when I have the ball at his feet, right? So um, obviously, if this card does come out as, a, as an SBC, if he doesn't come out as an SBC, I'm still uploading this because I'm not going to waste my time editing a video and then not put it out. could be a 5K bid. I'm still putting it out, you know? Um, so again, this is in the hopes of it getting an SBC. And if it does, uh, it's probably going to be around the 300K mark, 350K mark, I would say, um, for usability in game. The one that's trending on Flippin is the other one, which I find weird. There's no chance that they put this one as an SBC. But if they do, that would be hilarious because I'm like all over the fact that it's probably not going to be that one because they've been releasing like the, the base for some of the other cards, right? But guys, this is his best year in FIFA. Now, what I will say is that if you do end up using this card in game, I would recommend actually using him in the wing position because if you have a card like this on the comeback and defense instruction, like he follows it a little bit. But having a proper work rate in those side areas, it kind of makes more sense. Like that's great to have on the attack. But the lack of defensive stuff on the low work rates is sometimes a little bit annoying, especially if your tactics is set up a certain way. Like if you have that comeback and defense instruction, he'll follow it a little bit, but not as much as someone who's like a high medium or a high high. Right. So that's like the main concern with the card, obviously. But does Figo actually perform really well in game? Yes, this is his best year in any FIFA game because all of the other years, I'm going to be honest with you, he was complete trash. But this year, he's not complete trash, in my opinion. Like you could have given a footies version of Figo last year, and I still would have called that card trash. Like, it just was. I memed the video last year by putting a nice little goal in the beginning of the clips, just be like, oh, look at the goal we scored then. But he was trash, you know what I'm saying? So this year, significantly better for sure. Um, if you want to unlock him because you're building some sort of like Portuguese team or something, he'll actually be able to be good in the meta of the gameplay, which is a W. So, um, but yeah, hopefully you guys enjoy this video today. I'm going to die of laughter if it's not this one as an SBC. Peace out, dudes. Love you guys. Bro, I was dying of laughter at rea my reactions to the goals I was scoring. <laughs> I was dying, dude. Oh, dude, what are you going to do to score in this game? <laughs> it's like older highlights, too, because I was doing, like, formations and stuff, but too funny, man.